What's up, Lucha Gang? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel, my name is Kevin. Lucky is somewhere over there walking around. We are currently in Best Buy. It's a new day, but we're about to buy a new camera because I've been vlogging off my phone and my storage is just, yeah, going crazy. So we're looking at the cameras right now, but before we get the video going, make sure you stay true, hit the like button, don't be a hater of your life, subscribe right now. Zane, this one's huge. This is like for pictures, huh? Uh, I think we had this one. G7X Canon. G7? This one. It looks the same, right? Mark 2, this is Mark 3. So this one's newer. How much is it? This one's 750. And this one's 6. Twenty nine. That one over there is three ninety nine. Three ninety nine. Let's go look at it. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. What do y'all think, guys? Oh, it's the same thing. I am. I don't know. Why is it cheaper? Power shot. I don't know. It looks like the one we had. It's probably one of the first ones that came out. That's why. That is probably why. Sheesh. We've got a couple right here also. This one looks pretty dope. What is this? It comes with the mic? Help us. Wanna get somebody help us? Are you gonna say what's up to Lucci Gang? What up, Lucci Gang? What's up? What's up? What's up? Man, what's happening? What's up? <laughs> okay, so far, I think I like this camera. Um, which is this one right here. I don't know, it caught my eye. Um, and I looked up and there's this little thing right here, which is showing me that it goes well with this. And I'm kind of liking this situation. It's not too loud, simple, and it has the button to start recording. Do you need one of them sticks? That's what this is for. No, like a... I guess we can use that one, but they have more. We're waiting on um, one of the sales reps to come and look what we found here. Y'all, when I used to go to the washeteria to the laundry mat, this right here in Pac-Man. <gasps> no, no, no. Ah. You're out of there. <laughs> All right, guys. So, well, we got our camera. I'm so excited because... Yeah. Like I told y'all earlier, I've been vlogging off my iPhone, and yeah, that's another situation, another story for another time. But like he's on the phone with Anthony, shout out to Anthony and our whole entire team in Dallas, all over Texas, really. But um, yeah, let me know what do y'all what do y'all think? Y'all like the quality of this camera? Um, I don't even know what camera we got. Baby, you look like a movie star over there, baby. I showed y'all on the on the actual like display at Best Buy what camera we got, but yeah, I'm situated. I'm so excited today. Um, it's 1:41 a.m. It's about to be 11:41. Oh, 11:41 a.m. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a little like all over the place because I woke up early. I took Leah to the dentist. She got some dental work done. Um, and then, you know, we just been on our grind. We have some very exciting news for y'all guys. Man, let me say, I got, a, I got a praise report. That's what I got, man. I got a praise report for you. Shout out to all the Lucha Gang subscribers that been down with us since before the pandemic. We've been vlogging. And y'all know we've been trying to get into a new house. We've been looking at a bunch of houses for the last two, three years. We've been trying to get into a new house. More like four. And we could have been done, got into a, a you know, a regular little house. You know what I'm saying? But the the kind of house we needed, we have a lot of kids. We need room. I work from home. I need an office. So we needed the right square footage, the right amount of rooms, and a nice house. And we didn't want to just settle for you know moving to the house not that we didn't really want. So we prayed, 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 prayed. And when I tell you, you know what I'm saying? When you don't give up on your prayers and you keep on praying, 
God might not come on your time, but on God's time, it happens. And we just got approved like a couple weeks ago for the house and we move it next week, this Monday, less than a week. Like in a couple days, guys. Like that's what we've been doing. <laughs> like today's Wednesday. And we haven't been uh, vlogging or recording because we've been packing. We got our, you know, all our stuff packed, ready to go. We got movers coming next week to pick up all our furniture and take it to the new house. God is good, God is on time, God is faithful, even when you're not, baby. So we're super excited, guys, to share the whole entire journey with y'all. Um, like, like you just said, everybody that has been faithfully watching us since we started vlogging with our little family, our family has grown over the time, and y'all have witnessed that. And so, yeah, we're gonna be moving next week. Um, about to pull up to the house. Um, and we're gonna record every single, uh, step of the way i mean i am i'm gonna record for y'all guys so we just got the camera <clears throat> we're investing in this camera for y'all sorry that we've been falling short um on this end but promise you we've been working behind the scenes doing a lot of great things thank you jesus all glory to him hey and the house let me tell you about this house the house was the exact same model house that we saw in 2020 when we went to go look like two years ago when we first started looking at houses it was the exact same model house that we was trying to get and we was I was so like upset like because we didn't get approved for the house then you know what I'm saying and I was like dang man and then two years later having faith having faith having faith it's the same exact style house same builder same model house just on the and it's on this side of town that we live on not way on the other side of town so we got blessed, man. We got blessed. Thank you, Jesus. Come on into our old house. I'm already coming. Hey, man, our house, our, our walls are filled with laughter and love. You know what I'm saying? We're going to leave love and laughter. Ain't that right, Roro? Ro. New camera. Roro, Ro. daddy and mommy were Christmas shopping. Why are you naked? Looking like Mowgli from bad. the Jungle Book. He took a bath? Yes. Guys, so as you see, my walls are pretty naked. I then took most of the things down. I had my Christmas tree up and I had to box it up. Yeah, so. So we packed up, ready to go. It doesn't look like we packed up, but we really done packed up a lot of stuff. We have to demount that. I'm selling this. Actually, I'm having a garage sale. I'm having an everything must go garage sale this Saturday. Um, I'm not selling the couch, um, but I am trying to get rid of, uh, it looks a little crusty right now because we ate on it, but this breakfast nook table um, and the speakers along with a whole bunch of clothes, shoes, stuff like that, bar stools. I'm trying to like kind of upgrade at the new house. Um, but yeah, that's our situation guys. Right now, I'm just gonna clean up, tighten up, continue to pack the little things that are still left, like paperwork in the drawers and stuff like that. I'm waiting on some boxes. Kingston is about to, <laughs> Kingston's about to leave, guys. He's gonna go camping for the week uh, with one of his friends, which is a neighbor also. So this is like his little goodbye. A gathering with Eli, shout out to Eli, but they're going to a lake somewhere. And the girls are going to different schools. And uh, yeah, so Keys is about to head out. He's gonna go camping at a lake. Look how big lake my house. girls got. They almost as tall as me, man. Y'all remember when there was just little bitty tiny girls? Now look how big they are. They're about as big as me. They looking crusty. They need to go get themselves together. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, let me uh, get situated. I'll update y'all right now. Kingston! Come here boy, the Lucha gang miss you. That boy there, man. You hit him with the finger? Come here boy. There he is, there he is. Let me see Kingston, why are you covering your face? <laughs> God, I swear on TikTok boy, you weren't acting like that. Yeah, y'all should have seen him on TikTok. <laughs> y'all should have seen him on TikTok. Yeah, you're gonna break my phone again. Chill out. Chill out. Chill out. Chill out. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> Yo, as y'all know, we're finna move into the new house um, like the next week. I'm about to go on a trip with my friend uh, for Thanksgiving. Guys, look, I'm finna leave. Thanksgiving, son. Yeah, I'm about the same height, too. 
Anyways, hard. Kingston, like I said, he's leaving. You're heading out, right? Yes. Okay, have fun. May God bless you, all right? Have a great, happy yeah. Thanksgiving. Yeah, Enjoy myself. yourself. And please be careful, okay? okay. Tell him bye. Watch tell out for wolves. Yeah, tell him watch out for oh, wolves. Arnold. Give him a hug. You are a wolf? Yeah. Say happy Thanksgiving. Okay, Aww. Houston. It's Thanksgiving? Tomorrow it is. Say what's up to the Lucha gang. Hi. Hi, you're so sweet and cute and adorable. Oh my goodness. Okay, Kingston. You need another haircut, bro. Go tell your father, happy Thanksgiving, that you love him. Tell him thank you for letting you go. And adios. Houston, are you excited to eat for Thanksgiving? Yeah. You know what I'm making? No. I'm going to make fried chicken. Okay. Baked chicken. Bake. It's called butter garlic baked chicken. I'm going to make some baked mac and cheese. Mmm, you love mac and cheese? I'm going to make some green beans. Mmm. I'm going to make some some yams. <laughs> That's it? Yeah. Why do you keep nodding your head? Because I'm saying yes to what you're making. You like it all? Yeah. And like then for dessert, we're going to have apple pie and pumpkin pie. Yeah. Bye. All right, so. So. Kingston's so, heading out. Holla at you. Do you need something? You got everything you need? You got everything you need. Nah, I took you shopping yesterday. You're good. We're going to deposit some in your uh, card, but you should be straight. Anyways, all right, son. We love you. Okay. <laughs> Get him, bro. Get him. <laughs> okay, stop. Chase him out the door. Say, get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, Kingston just left, and I'm back to what I was doing, which is cleaning out this cabinet right here. I have basically already put everything up. All the little stuff, like, you know, the little messy stuff? That was our medicine cabinet, so I threw away a lot of old medicine, and I got this and I put all the stuff that we can still utilize in there. That way we can put them in a box and, you know, moving day we'll be able to take it over there easy uh, peasy. But, yeah guys, let's chit chat real quick. Um, I feel like we haven't talked and I'm really loving this camera and the way that it just focuses. So tomorrow is Thanksgiving, today is Wednesday and I'm very excited. I was just showing uh, y'all that I was telling Houston, what we're gonna make. Um, I'm gonna be making fried chicken, baked garlic butter chicken, um, yams, baked ma uh, mac and cheese. We're gonna be making cornbread. We bought rolls. I'm so excited. I'm really, really excited. Lucky was just talking about we eat big all year long, so it really doesn't like, you know, it's not really about the food for us, it's just about the vibes. And to me, the most important thing about this year's thanksgiving is it's really gonna be our last holiday in this house so i just want to make the best out of it and i'm excited for it type down below in the comments let me know what you have planned for thanksgiving what are you cooking what are you making low-key i wanted to make a salvadorian sandwiches the panes con pollo if you know you know but anyways uh, i don't know how to make them my mom knows how to make that and so yeah i need a lesson on that but Ugh, I was craving it so bad. I'm gonna stick with the chicken though, the American way. Um, yeah, we don't really like turkey, so I don't want it to go to waste. And I was like, that's why we're gonna make chicken. Um, and yeah, guys, quick little update, but boys are over here playing. I need to go and throw out some of their stuff out of their toy room. Um, not really throw it out, but you know, I'm having that garage sale and I have to box that stuff. I'm kind of low-key stressed for Saturday more than I am for the actual moving because I really want to just sell everything that I can and then I'll donate everything else. But here we are, guys. Ah! He is slumped. He ate some pizza and now he's knocked out. We're just big chilling. Kingston left a long time ago. Lucky just got off of a meeting and I want him to explain what just happened. Oh, we just got off a long call with uh, two agents out in LA that were selling universal index life policies. 
you might have seen on TikTok or on Instagram where these agents be talking about how you can be your own bank and borrow from your insurance policy and um, all that stuff. So they reached out to me on Instagram. I guess they were trying to recruit me. Pardon me, I just ate. I'm full. I need a burp. <laughs> Anyways, an I what is it? An IU IUL Index Universal Life Policy. It's like a whole life, right? Yeah. It's a whole life but, policy. But if you never went to like a class or got your securities license, an investment license, and really know about what a real investment is and what an insurance policy is, you wouldn't be able to know the difference. So those agents that sell those policies don't realize that they're ripping people off. And they sell them because they cost a lot and the client pays them and they get a high commission. So that's why those agents like selling those policies, but it's a rip off for the client. So we were, me and Anthony were on the call with this lady and this man from out there that were doing it. And we're basically letting them know we just do what's right for the client. It ain't about the commission we make, it's about what's doing right for the client. And when we compare apples to apples, you realize that a real investment is better than an insurance policy. Your insurance, life insurance should never be an investment or something you borrow from. That should be your life insurance for your life insurance. Your investment should be your retirement account, your Roth IRA or your mutual funds that you're investing in. That's your investment over there on that side. So when we showed the numbers and compared apples to apples, they realized that they were wrong and they were just doing it for the money. One of them got off the call and was like, oh, I gotta go. And the other one was like, how do I sign up? <laughs> it was a legit debate. We are trying to be professional. She said it at the beginning too. She was like, look, I don't want y'all to just think, try to come on here and try to clown us or we're just really, we're, we want y'all to educate us because what we're selling is this and we just feel like y'all could be making more money if y'all came over here and sold what we're selling. And then we said, well, it ain't about the money with us. It's about doing what's right for the client. And if I wouldn't get that universal index life policy on myself, why would I sell it to the client? You know what I'm saying? So that, that at the end of the day, it's just what type of person you are. are you a slime ball or you want to do what's right for the client i have never in my life heard the word slime ball baby you hear something new come up <laughs> out of my mouth every day anyways guys um i think i want to go christmas decorating like shopping christmas decoration shopping are you down babe all i heard was shopping <laughs> y'all i have this like whole theme i want to do at the new house um, I don't want to give it up, but there's an area that I want to do up, right? And uh, I want to go buy the things that I need for it. And I think we should go right now. There's a store down the street that's called Everything Christmas. And before we move out of this area, I want to go and get all the goodies. It's all right, we don't go, back. we gotta go. Cause I just ate, I'm ready to go lay it down. Let's go. You wanna come with us? Vamos. And now we're taking the whole squad. Walking and talking. Come on. I'm going to get a flower. You gave me a flower? Okay. You're so cute. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. How adorable is this? Y'all, they have everything here. Everything you can think of. Let's go this way. Go that way. Ooh, look at this nutcracker. This is a really nice nutcracker. Santa! <laughs> Big old bag of scary. Ooh la la, guys. I am thinking that our theme is gonna be all white with pops of. I don't like this pink. Maybe like a pop of rose blush. Uh, so we'll figure it out right now, guys. Here are these. These are super cute. Oh, guys. 
Okay, what's what going on? White decorations, a garland. I think I want to get the garland from Hobby Lobby though. All right, let's go check how much it is right here. I don't know what a garland is. Okay, so they have them here. This nine foot block, $99. <gasps> Say what? <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah this one Hobby Lobby, six, they have it cheaper. But it don't look like this. Yeah, I do. They have a whole bunch. They have actually, they have more than this. With the pine cones and all. Yeah, white. they have more than these. Thanks, so. I promise you. What? Can I have this in my new house? In your new house? Yeah, in my room. Let just show in Santa, your room? Mom. Yeah. Put a text in. Mom, I just saw Santa. You want it? You saw Santa? Yeah. Where's he at? He's right here. He's right here. Aww, you're so sweet. Okay, y'all tell Santa what y'all want for Christmas. I want a he's toy. He's not real. He's not real? Yeah, because he's a picture. Look. You want a toy? What kind of toy? Um, a dinosaur one. Oh, you're so adorable. What about you? What do you want for Christmas? Yeah, I know what I want. <laughs> no, I don't know what you want. Oh. <laughs> oh, any way you like to do it. Perfect. What'd you say? I got mini a mini stock. stocking. You got a mini stocking, huh? What are you gonna do with that? She gonna get it stuffed. I'm trying. Ah, hey, I'm excited. Ah, you wanna get on my bed? No one wants to get on your bed. Ah. All right, guys. <laughs> That store was a little pricey. We got a couple things and it was still a little pricey. <laughs> so we're gonna go to Hobby Lobby. I don't know if y'all know this, but Hobby Lobby every, uh, literally all year round, they have like a 50% off sale on whatever season it is, items. So we're gonna go because it's literally right here in the same shopping center. And unfortunately they didn't have all white ornaments here. For some reason they had an off-white or ivory, so. Hopefully Hobby Lobby has it. Let's go. Okay. So Gigi stayed in the car with Luck. We're walking up to Hobby Lobby. Cecilia, Houston, and Roro. And me. Let's go in here. So like I was saying, they have a larger selection of things here. White ornaments, baby. It's a shatterproof. Christmas decor. What do you think? These? I don't I don't think I like the size. I don't like how tiny they are. Let's go look. See, this size is better. Do you see the difference? Come on. I done told Lucky that they had a whole larger selection over here. Mm-hmm. Let's see what we figure out. Okay, guys, so... So far, we've got a couple of goodies. I don't know if y'all can see. Um, they look really nice. Um, but I'm still trying to walk around and see. What else can we find? Anyways, guys, back in action. Every single day, we're gonna come with a video. I'm making a commitment. Man, you know how many times we done said that? I have a camera now, so it's different. Situation's different. We have a lot going on. Love, peace, and hair grease. We're gonna holler at y'all. <laughs> Stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog. I'm gonna be showing y'all how I make my Thanksgiving meal. Um, and yeah, we'll see y'all when we see y'all.